Hello and welcome to Rise of Cultures. This is another beta update and on beta we just have this new feature unlocked and uh, well we're going to test it the next probably four to six weeks and uh, there's a ranking up here. It's not working yet. I'll make another update when uh, some of the known bugs are already um, well removed. Now first off you would start with uh, setting up your defensive army so people don't get too easy to get points from you. Now as you can see I have three archers in defensive line here and uh, I have uh, three groups of uh, light infantry in front of them. Well, uh, when you place the units it's uh, dragged from your barracks but you can just when you put the first two down refill your barracks and put the third group of archers which is a defensive advantage because you can't do it in the attack. I saw another person who has used the heavy units from uh, Wonders and uh, the 3x2 up here. Well, he can have three heavy units up here and a light infantry unit. It works pretty effective and again you can't really counter it with the same amount of troops so you need a better strategy or better bonuses because well you can never have more than two at a time of heavies attacking at the same time. Now let's just move out here and see how it goes when you attack. Of course you can see over here the uh, ranking and uh, well it is announced the top 10 is uh, moving on. I can see there is on uh, special prizes for being first place but uh, that's okay. The tournament goes for one week and uh, well down here you get uh, some of the new uh, things you can uh, buy. There is uh, another attack here and uh, choose some uh, extra commanders. Uh, there's nothing on the defender yet but I hope there comes something at some point. And here's the what the overall where well, you can have uh, refills to your barracks and a little goods and uh, a healing potion. You can see your collection up here. You have uh, attempts here. It's on um, beta. It should be a new one for every two hours, and you can even buy one for a uh, ten of your rank points, and you can go on all the time. Now, how many do I get of these? I'm not sure what they're called. You can't click on them. And these should be getting from defending, these from attacking. So basically if you attack you should be able to do just fine. Now look here, I'm in the Roman Empire and uh, that Iberian era, if I can beat his forces I will give a uh, well quite high amount of strategy points. But if I attack someone well a lot easier. I'll only get 10 other points, so that's not really beneficial, but uh, that's what it is. Now, let's take someone, uh, what's uh, got a Roman Empire here? Let's take him. He's the same age as I have, am, but it doesn't seem like you have set up a defensive army, so, well, it's easy points. But we will also be able to see what we gain from winning, aside from already stated things. Let's just beat them up. It can't take long. You can also see how the AI uses these uh, commanders. So, well, you can see the second uh, wall. It just it just sit there. It's not. It can do with some uh, improvements that AI, but uh, that's okay. But note here, you get 15 attack points, and you know it. It only costs 10 over here. I hope to some point that that is a beta related uh, issue because otherwise you can just attack infinitely until your arms falls off and well I'm not sure that's really the intention but uh, well that will be given as feedback if it hasn't already been I haven't been able to read through it all but I'll say thank you for watching this video and I uh, hope you look forward to the new feature they have presented to the beta community